it's not working. It's not working. Why isn't it working? Three things that is very important. It can help you manifest. First, is it handmade? Second, the timing that it was purchased. And third, is it someone who made it very specific for the intention that you're manifesting? And one of the secrets, is it gifted to you? This bracelet is free and is specific to your sign. More than hundreds of thousands of people get their bracelets from us. Visit our website, find out more at ttglove.net. I didn't come to your feed randomly. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? <laughs> well, you wanted a reading. Okay. Well, I'm here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> there are things that is not working. It's not working. It's not working. This one will work. Are you manifesting money? Just letting you know, because your first card is ten of pentacles. I want money, lots of money. Okay, I give you the first three tips and the secret sauce. Okay, for manifestation, and I'm gonna talk about it because your evil eye. Okay, this is your evil eye pyrite is free. Your zodiac piao is back. The smoky quartz. Remember that? Mm, or if you haven't, well, I'm gonna talk more about it. Okay. That's free. And today's the last day, guys, to get this uh, Lucky 7. You can still get your Pirate free. Okay, but I just don't have, I feel like I don't have the Ruby, enough Ruby, or the Yellow Sapphire. Okay, hundreds of thousands already. <laughs> Same thing as the coins that is coming your way. Ten of Pentacles. I see a lot of money for this. Whoa! <laughs> Did you hear that? Did you hear that? If you heard that, that's a sign, okay? Because every time I get this kaching kaching sound, okay? Um, when someone gets your piao, okay? You heard that, right? I hope you heard. Ten of Pentacles is here, okay? I should adjust the mic a little bit, okay? Um, the Ten of Pentacles is coins, stability. This is something related to, let's just say, about your family also, long term. This is good health. It's a completion. Nine of Pentacles is uh, the, you know, the completion, the result of what you've worked hard for is the 10. Okay, Capricorn, we are serving a lot of Pentacles. We love, so can we talk about, of course it's me. We're going to talk about your money, your career, your love life. And we're talking about, of course, your pyrite. Um, you're talking about your smoky quartz, yes. And this is uh, May. I already moved the calendar here to the mid of May. I like to do that so that the sun will shift. Okay. So let's begin. Let's talk Ten of Pentacles, right? Okay. Do indulge. Okay. Now, Saturn is in the second house, which normally, yes, as a transit, it can become just a little bit complicated. Okay. We don't want Saturn in the second. But if you're trying to get a whole, a good control of your finances, this is this one. You may make enemies though, your family, because you're not borrowing, you're not bar you're not letting them borrow can be finances. Okay, like money. Um, you might get accused that you're not supporting them, you're not there for them, or friends or family, but you're there. Okay. It's just so happened like you just you're prioritizing certain things in your life. You're a grown person now. I need to look after myself. And then, you know, basically, uh, you know, do the right thing. People don't understand when we're working within. They might, you might get hate for that. Okay. Now, the Ten of Pentacles, uh, other factors that we're looking at for your finances, of course. Since, okay, Mars is not with Saturn anymore. And Mars where Saturn was in the second house for you for quite some time. Mars rules the 11th house of earning. Saturn is controlled. That's why, um, you know, the Graha Saturn has rings. It's like restriction, right? Now, since Mars is not there anymore, well, money comes in again. And then what you make, you will keep and nobody can borrow, okay? So think of it like you will put this on like CDs, like what do you call it? That CD, right? Um, certificate deposit, something like that, you know, or like a long-term bond savings. This is going to be good for the future for you. Okay? So that's one thing that I'm seeing here with the Ten of Pentacles. As far as like long-term relationship, I've already told you about the Yellow Sapphire. If you got yours already, make sure you carry it. Jupiter is already in the fifth house. One of the best placements for Jupiter is in the fifth. Jupiter in the five and the nine is going to be good as a transit. Yes. So 
here it's giving uh how do you call this joy and happiness look at that everybody is celebrating okay of course their life still goes on up and down but with jupiter in the fifth it gives you that optimistic energy and vibe the sun is going to be in taurus during that time two degrees remember i do sidereal vedic astrology not western so that time when the sun is in Taurus, it will illuminate. Remember, Taurus is to have what you can have. Okay, you will see. It's like, oh, I want that. Oh, I want to go on vacation. Oh, you know what? I'm going to buy a house. Okay, Ten of Pentacles. Your desire is caused by Rahu, though. Rahu in the third, you are fearless. Okay, may have issues with sibling, though, with Mars and Rahu in the third house. So I need you to be careful how you discuss and conduct business with regards to your siblings. Yes. But look at that. I have done so much good readings on April for the Capricorn. I'm just letting you know. But I know nobody likes a good reading. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm just, I'm just saying because misery loves company, right? And not a lot of people are in their happy place. But whoever's watching, I'm happy that you're happy. <laughs> Wheel of Fortune. Of course, of course, I'm in this journey to help the one that's not in the good place. Okay, so I have no problem with that. I just wish people would connect with this one too, right? Wheel of Fortune, with a t because definitely if it's about cheating, oh, he did this, she did that, blah, blah, everybody connects with that. But when I say money comes to you, no, it doesn't, it doesn't make sense. I don't have that. It will come to you. You have to have the faith. Wheel of Fortune is faith. Wheel of Fortune is time, right? So this, from what I'm seeing, it's the time that what you have... um what do you call this, gone through as a cycle, because Wheel of Fortune is like, it's, you know, it's spinning always, you will get it now, right? Okay, that's why I was giving you the, the pyrite. Pyrite is the fool's gold. Mm. Okay, Queen of Swords, cutting certain things in life, and look at that. When I say cutting, Queen of Swords is actually divorce or divorcee, so separation. Um, Queen of Swords does not, uh, you know, like, they're not, how do you call this? They don't waste their time because for them, I've wasted enough time that I cannot waste anymore. Does it make sense? Now you value it, who you spend time with, what kind of work you have, what's, you know, with certain investments that you're going to put in energetically. You're very much like um, you're upfront with it. And here comes the good news. You got an emperor and the will of fortune. Who is this? Who's your daddy? A workaholic to another workaholic. Now, Capricorns are definitely in, in the food chain. They're on the top. You're talking about these are, is that apex? Is that the right word? These are the champions. They're always winning. For what I wanted for them, something that attracts more wealth. The money, the success, the fame, why not? So I made a pyrite, evil eye bracelet for them. And this just works like magic. Check it out. It's available in our website. Who's your daddy? <laughs> oh my, here we go. Emperor right here. That's an Aries, right? That's an Aries. That's someone who is ready for commitment. Could it be Sal? Hangman. Okay, so you're going to think about it. Now, one thing that I don't want you to think about, okay, is if you have to think about, should I get the double Piao? Well, the smoky quartz with the citrine and the double Piao. The double Piao removes obstacle, okay? So... You pet the Pia, wear it on your left wrist, okay? The smoky quartz, I have it in front of my house, okay? When you get this, the double Pia, well, you get your pyrite evil eye. Remember, it has to be gifted. Intention is there already for you guys. And, of course, the time that it was purchased, we're celebrating fifth year. Us here, everybody, is in celebration. So this will bring good energy to you. Now, this is free. You add this to your cart. You go to the bottom and you will see there. You choose the Capricorn one, okay? Now, this is still free if you get your lucky seven. I just don't know the time that it's uploaded if it's still available. Okay, so if it is, snag it, okay? Because this is it for the, for the lucky seven, the mega wealth. Now, may I suggest that if you're going to choose this as your sun sign, okay, you can choose this one as your moon sign. You can do a moon in Sagittarius, moon in Capricorn. You can choose there at the bottom. Why moon sign for this bracelet? I'm just suggesting, but you can still do your sun or ascendant. The reason being is the evil eye that I have put here is to protect the mind. Because once the mind is weak, 
stress, anxiety, depression, you know, overwhelmed feelings, we won't be able to make good decisions in life. So as a suggestion, if you can get this base, because this is free, right? You just choose your moon sign if you want to, okay? So I'll put it here. Free shipping in the U.S. and we ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. The yellow sapphire, very few left when you get your lucky seven. Very few. When I say very few, it probably won't last at the end of the day when the tenant is uploaded, okay? So hangman with the emperor, okay? So the, the emperor right here, okay, is about taking charge. You're in the hangman. You'll think about it if you like them. Okay. So this comes to you. With Jupiter in the fifth, it will come to you. Okay. Oh, I love, I love, I love, love, love. <laughs> Ten of cups right here. I hope Chrissy is good. Okay. So here, love, love, love. Okay. I wish him. I wish her well. Ten of cups with the Ten of Pentacles right here. You're forever. <laughs> now, Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles with the Wheel of Fortune, right? Okay. It's time, Capricorn. It's time. It's time for you to be happy, your wish being fulfilled, the family is healthy, you know, the support that you needed. Now, of course, it would vary from if you are a moon in Capricorn. I know you are at the end of your Sadisati, which means after the Sadisati, you'll feel a sense of relief, right? But just looking at your just looking at your um, cards right now, Ten of Cups with the Ten of Pentacles, this is looking very, very bright, right? Look at that. Someone really wants to give you this long-term partnership, Emperor and the Ten of Cups. We love, we love, we love, we love, we love, right? Okay, let's see. Eight of Cups, okay, Six of Wands and the Fool, okay. From what I'm seeing here, for some, it could be a person that has walked away from your life for some. Because this is about second chances. Six of Wands is that you have left also that behind you. Meaning that's a closed chapter. I'm moving forward. I want what Sal was saying. You know, he's seeing the future for me. That it's going to be bright. So I'm always I'm all about that brightness, Sal. Bring me that light, Sal. No one's dying, okay? Don't go to the light, okay? <laughs> Six of Wands here with the full card. A leap of faith taking chance, that's from them, not from you, okay? So life do get better. Guess who's back? <laughs> okay, what else that I'm seeing for you guys here? Okay, um, if you're trying to manifest harmony in your home right now, which is, uh, let's just say, attracting love and relationship, a little bit, okay, uh, how do you call this? A little bit like redecorating at the house flowers is gonna be good yes um light colors is gonna be good inside the house to bring harmony and peace okay let me see seven of wands the ace of pentacles two of wands and the ace of swords someone here okay ace of pentacles two of wands and ace of swords their intention okay is to ace of pentacles is um how do you say this is you want something serious okay you want something serious um, Ace of Pentacles, Two of Wands, and the Ace of Swords. Your person wants to tell you that because Ace of Swords is victory. The Pentacles is the coins. The Two of Wands is like they've been waiting. And I feel like on your end, this comes to your doorstep. Okay. And that's why I keep saying, okay, even the Citrine in your Piao, okay, is going to be good for your relationship. The Citrine that I put here. Remember, the intention is very important and who made it. Okay, these are handcrafted treasures. That's what I call it. So things are lining up. Victory, Ace of Swords, money comes to you, right? Clear understanding and communication is here with the Ace of Swords. We love that. God-given opportunity, which is here. Divine timing at work, Wheel of Fortune. Ten of Cups is now finally sell. You gave us something good. I always give you something good. Your choices is the one that make it not so good. But now you're doing the right thing. 
And what could be more better than doing the right thing? When getting your Piao, of course, because I created it specifically for your sign. Okay? I'll tag this in the corner of this video. You guys know the spiel. Before the end of the day, I gotta go to the mail. So go check it out. Free shipping in the US and we ship to more than 80 countries across the globe. It's just getting started with me. I'm so thrilled and I have so much to share for this month. I'll see you.